up, YouTube? It's your boy Kilo Cali Hustle, aka the Ghetto Nerd, back again. I told myself I had to do this tonight. I've it's been way too fucking long. This is the official second episode, number two, of Random Thoughts. And first things first, I'm gonna get this bullshit out of the way so I can get to what I actually want to say. The title is Sorry for the Wait. That has nothing to do with Drake. I don't want people to think that I'm showing him love or I'm disrespecting him because I don't really give a fuck about the dude at all, personally. Um, I like maybe a handful of his songs. So it's not about trying to get more views. It has nothing to do with that. I just really... I'm apologizing because, I mean, I, I did... It's been since pretty much April or May since I've done a Random Thoughts episode and I know I don't really have a big fan base I don't have a lot of people that are sitting here waiting for me to put out a video but I, like I said in my first one I don't give a fuck I don't care if I have 5 fans, 500 fans, 5,000 fans I'm gonna keep doing what I do keep telling you how I feel and keep giving my life to you guys because that's what I'm about I'm about this music and I'm about bringing people together and I just wanna, you know, get my opinions out there so fuck it um, quick thing, I want to shout out somebody, I already have a number one hater off of that first Random Thoughts video, apparently his name uh, is uh, Cincinnati Shit on Google+, Plus. so I guess all of the shit in Cincinnati came together and decided they had a Google Plus account, I don't know, but uh, he shared my video and said, what the fuck did he say, pretty much something along the lines of, no one cares, turn off your camera and talk to yourself, so whatever, you know what I mean? That shit don't phase me. Um, obviously, someone cared enough to share the video, so pfft, whatever. Uh, quick, while I'm thinking about it, I just uploaded a video today. If you're a fan of Tech Nine, I did a little demo of my verse that I have on the first Midwest Choppers beat. Go check that out. And I also did a diss uh, about a, not even a week ago for Slim Jesus motherfucker and a lot of people could probably say oh you're hopping on the bandwagon oh you're trying to use his name blah 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 again that has nothing to do with that fucking bullshit I just like music and the dude was running his mouth to me on Instagram on some stupid shit because you know my ghetto nerd shit he told me go catch a Pokemon and blah 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 so real quick on that I just saw a video the other day with him on Vlad TV talking about, yeah, I rap about guns, but I'm not out here catching bodies and shit. You know, I'm smart. So, real quick, fuck that bullshit. If you don't rap about it, if you don't live that life. Like, that's why I hate music nowadays. You've got so many motherfucking fake ass people out there, you know, talking this shit, talking that shit, you know, talking about, oh, I'm gonna go kill this dude, oh, I'm gonna sell these drugs, knowing damn well they've never popped a fucking gun in their life, they've never sold a rock in their life, and that's a fucking false image that you're presenting to these kids, and that's not what my music is about, I will never be about that, yeah, I get creative and I make up stories sometimes, that's one thing to have fun and create a story, but it's a totally another thing to present a false image of yourself and present this, god what the fuck is this word I'm looking for, this lifestyle, this image to your audience, to your fan base, you know, like that's okay, so fuck that, I'm gonna move on from that, um, I'm gonna make another video now that uh, my girl has her school computer and which means whenever she's not doing schoolwork, you're gonna be looking at my face a lot. So I promise from this point forward to do at least three Random Thoughts videos a month. If I'm lucky, I'm going to try to do one every Saturday. So I will be consistent. And what I wanted to do back in the summer, it's not, well, it's still technically summer, but before, like when summer had started, I wanted to do my second video all about um, E3. And, you know, talk about E3 and my opinions on the games that were coming out and stuff like that. But, excuse me, you see how that failed. So, I'm going to look quick for a couple seconds and say, fuck Halo 5. I don't give a shit what they have to offer. I don't give a rat's ass. My personal opinion, Halo has gone downhill ever since Reach came out. Um, I'm not going to try to get, I'm not, I don't want this video to be all about that because... That's just going to be another 10 minute video and I'm not really trying to have super long fucking videos every time because I know people don't want to sit here for 10, 20, 30 minutes watching someone talk. But that's just how it is sometimes. I'm random as fuck and sometimes I go and talk about more fucking shit. So any nerds out there that would care to have a spirited debate about E3, about you know maybe you're, you think you're really excited about Halo 5. 
tell me what you think. I'm totally down for that. Uh, anyone that has the Xbox 360, my gamer tag is Calulus Chaos. I will put it somewhere around here, somewhere. Um, for those that don't know, follow me on Instagram, the underscore ghetto underscore nerd. Uh, Kill a Cali Hustle on Facebook and Twitter. All one word. Um, let's see what the fuck. So news. The Ghetto Nerd EP that I've been working on forever now. Random thoughts for those of you that know dropped back in on 420 of this year, and it was kind of rushed because I've been working on it for so long, and I dropped it on 420. I wanted to have more shit out, and I'm taking my time with Ghetto Nerd. Uh, I want this to be really, really good EP for you guys. Um, I don't have an official release date yet, but I will be dropping the cover on Halloween. So keep out for that, and I will definitely be putting some little bonus tracks, or not bonus tracks, but promo tracks along the way, uploading within the next month or two. Um, one that you particularly, the first track I will be releasing from Ghetto Nerd is actually a remix to Jaren Ben's Schizo track. And I sent him an email. Hopefully he responds soon. If not, I'm going to try to hit him up when he comes to Cincinnati at Bogart's. Funk volume will be here on October 8th. So I want to try to spit it for him and get his permission to call it the official remix for Schizo. Because I'm not about to do that without his permission because that's just grimy. Um, also, more update for those of you who don't know. Um, Back in July, October, or July 31st, I opened up for Whitney Payton at the Thompson House over in Kentucky. It was an amazing show. Whitney Payton is a cool-ass fucking artist. For those of you that know, don't know, look her ass up. She's dope as shit, and she's a real down-to-earth person. She's real cool and talking. So shout-out to Whitney Payton. Um, shout-out to Funk Volume. I can't wait to see you guys in October. I was hoping to try to get an opening slot for that, but as far as I know, shit's probably going to be butt. Pro they might not even have any openers and I'm not even going to drop his name but the dude that opened for Hop two years ago for the Knock Madness tour got booed off stage because he's whack as fuck but we can't do anything about that because he's butt buddies with the fucking promoter the main promoter in Cincinnati so he gets all these good ass opening shows and he doesn't want to see any other local shine so fuck that bullshit fuck that dude I'm not even going to drop his name um, some of you may know who I'm talking about so whatever uh, moving forward alright I'm gonna try to wrap this up and keep this at least at 10 minutes because I don't want to just go on and fucking be talking and talking and talking and talking um, what I'm gonna try to do with every video is either start and or end my video with a, a 16 a free 16 verse um, not a freestyle but just a written verse um, just to add a little spice to it, you know what I mean, add a little hip-hop to each video that I do. Uh, I might actually be putting out two more random thoughts this weekend, just because I have a lot of shit that's built up, so I want to drop out. Uh, I'm going to be talking about my first video, I talked about how I went to Team Backpack for Mission Underground, and I said that, I was talking about the Joel Ortiz thing. Um, I did not have all the information at that time, so that's why I didn't really speak on it, but now I do, and I saw the grind mode cipher, and I've got to say, personally, fuck Joel Ortiz, because you recycled the shit out of that verse. That was really unprofessional. But, the dude that was in the crowd that flipped out for no reason, well, not for no reason, but flipped out because he was, like, in grind mode cipher, one of the owners or whatever, that was extremely unprofessional as fuck, too. You know, if you guys are, you know, no disrespect to grind mode, you guys are dope, but if you guys are a professional business and you're about your shit, then you maybe should have had him sign a contract, something that gives you personal rights to that verse, so he couldn't do some shit like that. So I'm going to speak on it, I'm going to do a whole nother video, my next round of thoughts is going to be about Team Backpack, or should I say Team Slack Pack, my personal opinions on them, and my some other stuff that I have that I have to talk about and I might you know some people may call it career suicide because I'm gonna be fucking telling you guys how I really feel and what the truth is but I don't give a shit so I'm gonna drop I'm about to finish this up because it's getting about that time I'm gonna drop this 16 I wrote this right when I got back from uh, Mission Underground so I hope you guys like it 
I may be a long way from winning varsity, yeah, but never fear. I'm about to make myself abundantly clear. If you think I'ma just fall off and quit this career, you got another thing coming. There's so much more to hear. I barely begun to peak, so sit down and relax. You can call me how you want and throw me in with the trash, but I'ma rise to the top like the cream of the crop. Spreading love from California all the way to the Bronx, back down to the place that I'm living in now. Cincinnati, Queen City, yeah, we holding the crown, cause I'm the new kid on the block and I I got the right stuff if you hate trying to knock my hustle you getting stuck and stuff inside the back of a black truck where no one can hear you scream cause the music's turned up and your body won't be found for at least six months that's what you get for messing with a killer that's rough uh one love peace and love uh whoop whoop much wicked clown love keep it random and have a great one guys i'm out